Hey. This channel is sponsored by Alpha Draft. Check the description to play it. Hey. Yep, this is my tea list. If you have any questions, go for it. Just go for it. Wow, I'm super thirsty right now. Like, I'm really, really thirsty. Hey, hey. I need a drink. Like, wow. How's Freya so low? Okay, I'll try to explain why Freya is that low. Let's grab the tier list again. So, I put Freya right here. A lot of gods are like above her. Um, I believe she has a very, very, very weak early game. And her end game is shaky as well. I think ADC is actually beat her for days with the new runic shield. 20% reduction at the attack speed. You don't really compensate that that easily. If you look at Fatalis, like besides the passive, it only gives 30% attack speed and movement speed. But besides the mobility, it only gives you 30%. That's reduced. Only 10%. That's all of our one, one item. Besides the mobility, obviously. I don't think she's that good anymore. Just I think her, just her end game is shaky with the runic shield. Don't go Runic Shield and Frostbound against her because it doesn't stack. I think Runic Shield, uh, Titan's Bane and Fatalis is a good combination. Take Nia Tabi, not Warrior Tabi. Because you like attack speed. I think Titan's Bane is huge. Especially goes like Hoji with Titan's Bane will shred through uh, Freya for days. And with Runic Shield it's ridiculous. And Shield of the Underworld is also a huge factor why Freya is not that fancy anymore. Shield of the Underworld does a lot against that god. Can you send Link? Yeah, you can send Link, sir. Is my opinion on jazz? It's certainly not the way it is, so you can never make this game is way too cool. Bye!